Yo, 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 what's up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to Vusi Max. You're really not a vibe. I mean, today's video is a very important one in the building. I should have made this one a long time ago, but time and time again, I just run into people who don't know or who haven't yet opened the first trading account, right? So, me, now you know my setup is a uh, thing. Right now, my setup is a uh, vault market. So, I'm going to plug you with the link. I'm going to treat you nice. The service is nice. A1. And the withdrawals are fast right so this video will be more like a tutorial on how to open an account trading account with uh vault markets you know the vibes so i'm gonna explain every type of account that they have in the in the options list and compare which one is better and stuff like that and whatever and also how to log into mt4 because that's a little bit tricky for like someone who never ever like used mt4 you know what I'm saying so it's kind of tricky but i'm gonna explain this just watch till the, till the end the, the end part will be the how to log in using mt4 part if you want to know how to use like mt4 to open and close trades i'm gonna pin the link to that video because i dropped that video a long time ago i'm gonna pin the link in the in, in the comment section and in the description box that's what i'm trying to say you understand so come on i'm doing what i need to do you gotta do what you need to do for me you know subscribe like comment click the bell notification icon so you don't miss out on any future drops all right let's go all right fam so i'm not gonna take any more of your time we're gonna go straight to my chrome oven because i wanna i want this video to become a demonstration so to speak like a step by step how to square it up you understand so we opening up a uh, vault markets thing so obviously like you don't even need to know www.w just go to your google search uh vault markets you can see the first results and you understand so you're gonna go to vault markets uh this one the the, the normal link that's gonna take you to the site not the login or what but anyhow we're just gonna go there ah that's what's up so let's do it like this you're gonna go to register register is here so you're gonna go to register uh this is what i was gonna do you like this one depends if you're a company or you're a what what or you're trading as an individual you know so i don't know how you're gonna do it if you wanna do it as a company but dog i know most of most of you watching this now wanna open an account where you like trading as an individual so go to individual first names you understand don't copy my stuff though all right so when you're done filling up the the first page it should look somewhat like this right your name your last name your email address your password set a password for like when you want to log into the website and then select the country that you're in and then they're gonna put the country code which is for your phone number and then just put the rest of the digits and go to register now right done signing up right now so but we're not done yet there's still a lot that we need to do you understand so i'm gonna guide you through like all the steps you know along the way so please note that your kyc is not complete uh uh okay so the kyc is what now okay so you're gonna go to kyc so since it's like on top let's just go to the kyc and see what's going on but actually they still put me here Still in, in, still in this page so i guess this is what we need to get done first you understand so account comparison table so now this is where it starts to become fun yeah you know? so there's mt5 and there's mt4 right and this is this is what like the major difference is so for mt4 now you can pick your currency of the account right account currency and then you can select all these are like different types of of, of uh, accounts well it's the same account but they have different benefits and stuff like that so the vault 200 i'm going to exp explain this one the vault 200 is the 200 percent bonus meaning when you fund every time you fund this type of account you get 200 percent of the money that you put in but that money you can't withdraw you can only use it to trade like to open more trades but if you lose the amount you have in your balance the credit automatically gets uh discredited or something like that like they you know gets forfeited so to speak the 100 percent works the same way as the 200 you get 100 percent of the amount that you funded with if you fund 1000 rands they're also gonna give you uh, a 1000 rands credit so you can open more trades uh, so you can use more leverage in your trades but you know it, 
it goes with the with the lesson in leverage if you know how to use leverage this is very good if you don't know how to use leverage then you can stick to the vault no bonus meaning you only trade raw with the amount that you have in your account the vault zero i have no idea what's going on with this one vault 1000 i really don't know what's going on with this one also because i don't really even use this thing i understand now what they're saying so the vault 1000 i think is the 1000 1 is to 1000 leverage you understand so you can open more trades but i don't think it comes with a bonus this one the vault zero no bonus vault swap free you don't get charged to hold your trades overnight i think that's what it means i'm not sure you might have to you know inquire micro is for micro uh account if you want to trade micro indices micro uh currencies and stuff like that meaning they require less funds they're not the same as like standard current like uh, currencies or standard indices that you'll find on you know on a standard account this one is like if you want to find couple 400 rands 500 rands you know that kind of stuff and like learn a strategy it's very good for learning a strategy before you actually go into the big boys and trade standard things accounts you know so let's go ahead we we'll go with the most popular one which is the vault uh 200 200 which is the 200 uh, percent bonus so you can just go there select if you want your account to be in usd or in za you see and then you can go you can choose anyone to act, uh, basically explain what's going on isn't it so you can choose any of these ones and then you can go to open account and proceed right open account and proceed in the building so now this is gonna send you the account details and even if you can try to log into this one this is a banner account i'm just opening it to demonstrate you're not gonna trade my funds from film so i'm just gonna take a screenshot of this you know that's what i do so i don't forget uh the account logins and stuff like that i'm gonna show you how to log in also like at the end of this video so after we've opened uh an account eh? now they're saying the thing kyc is not incomplete like they said when we just logged in so i'm gonna say i understand sharp so now we need to like finish up uh signing up so basically in this uh thing in this page well this section of the because you need to fill in personal details right you need to fill in your intended amount uh that you're gonna deposit currency you know from the country that you're in uh first name last name id number nationality country street city and postal slash zip code and then after that you need to clarify are you a u.s citizen for tax purposes i am not a u.s u.s citizen so i usually say no you understand so i'm gonna show you the next page after filling all the things i just said now so this will be the next page that it takes you to you understand so uh the same you've selected amount of 1000 rents to deposit to change amount press back and what was so i need to think choose a payment method so there's uh, a straight bank transfer packs full pay fast visa mastercard and then also mina i prefer this one this is like the best one for me you understand because i'm just going to show you the next page real quick so you can see how it looks uh you understand so this is why what, what i like about uh, this payment method hey what's going on this is what i like about it it has all the banks basically in sa i think africa has more like fnb and stuff like that so even if you're not an sa but if you're using fnb it's 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 supported in a lot of uh countries so it's gonna cover you in that in that sense you understand so um i'm not depositing for real because i told you why you understand so let me just cancel we can go to the back the page before this one all right so if you like because you registering so you can start trading then this is what you're gonna do you're gonna have to fund now then we're gonna proceed you understand so when you go back to your thing now right when you go back to your thing because basically i'm on account details right now right so you need to resume the it's gonna show you like you need to uh continue with the account opening process so they need email address validation you need to upload upload documents these are the three things that we left with email address 
uh, upload documents and then financial details and then to make a deposit with the to make a deposit which i already showed you how to do understand so you can go to resume uh -huh. so now i'm gonna say deposit later and then now we can continue with the questions that they need to you know what i'm saying questions they need to basically understand before they can let you trade like before they can let you in their platforms and trade with them and stuff like that you understand what i'm saying though so vault market is the plug occupation I mean, i'm a hustler dog so uh i can just say but depend this depends on what you're doing you understand but they give you options your occupations you need to fill it in your source of funds where, you, where are you getting those funds you understand and then the bank that you use you need to fill that in and then the country you know and then bank account number right after you fill in your bank account number uh are you considered a legal citizen in two or more countries like if you have citizenship in two or more countries then you would say yes but for me no you know what i'm saying and then so i'm gonna fill this in and then i'll show you the next page now so this is the next page basically this is like the final page you know so what's what they're saying now is you need to wait until we receive the response from the verification engine a pop-up will appear in the verification when the verification ends keep in mind keep in mind excuse me that uh you can still trade regardless even if you're not verified yet but you just cannot withdraw unless your documents are verified so this is this is gonna be a personal choice that you need to make you can either wait for your documents to get approved and then fund after which is what i prefer get your documents approved and then fund after and then you can start trading and withdrawing knowing that everything is verified and you don't have to like do the back and forth when you now want the money you understand that's not gonna be a nice experience uh okay so now we need to verify your identity so they need a identity document uh so you like just to take a picture of your thing it's best i feel like if you're doing this on the hey dog i'm looking at profits you understand we're winning here so i think it's best if you are operating on a on a smartphone but even on a pc you can just send the stuff to your pc and then you know your id and the proof of rest and then you can start verification and basically that is it you understand that is it for that part and then the only thing that will be left uh yeah basically that's it it's just to open an account and then once you're done with that part I think that's when your account will be open but let me just check but actually we do have an account open so you know now you need to go to your dashboard right now you need to go to your dashboard and then from your dashboard you can see there's your trading accounts and stuff like that but if you want so i from now that we're almost done with the registration process there's just a little things a little few like a few things that i need to think that i need to explain over you understand so every time you log into the to the website it's gonna show like this you understand every time you log in it's gonna start show like this and then what you need to do basically because so you see now so these are my trading accounts so the trading account you open you're gonna find it here under my trading accounts so when you make a deposit your funds go to your wallet right and then so if your funds are in your wallet just scroll down this works also on the on the mobile platform just go to my wallet and then go to my trading account and choose a trading account right and then now you should be able to move your funds from the wallet to the trading, trading account the thing is now on this one i don't have any funds so maybe that's why it's showing excuse me so maybe that's why it's showing the way it's showing now and then this is your mt4 login so you remember when i opened the thing when i opened the account they give me excuse me the password which i took a screenshot of so that's what i'm gonna use to log into the mt4 which i'm gonna show you shortly after this so now you can go to my profile if you just if you want to check if your documents are verified and stuff like that they'll show you so when you go to your your thing your profile they'll show you all the details that are thing that are verified there and then there's upload documents and stuff like that so everything you're gonna find it here that you need to verify basically understand so 
now the only thing that's left i feel like is to is to uh log in on the mt4 platform awesome so what you want to do right you want to go to after this is after you registered everything you want to go to your app store if you're using ios if you're using android go to your google play store go and search mt4 right go and search mt4 and the first result that's what you want to go to mt4 meta trader 4 right so because it's already downloaded that's why i'm saying open right so you just want to go in you understand just want to go into the mt4 now you want to go to trade accounts on settings you want to go to settings trading accounts and then you want to go to add new account and then go to log into existing account and then you're going to choose you're going to search for company name there you want to type vault markets live you understand so what you want to do now remember i took this screenshot in the beginning this is because i need these details that are update that's just the details i used to log into this thing right and this is not a tutorial on how to use metatrader 4 that tutorial has already been out a long time ago but i'm gonna link it in the description box below so the password that you want to use you want to use the password don't go to investor password the investor password is what you use when you're trading for someone you want the person to see how you're trading so use the trade the investor pa use the password the investor password isn't gonna allow you to to trade and so this is after i've entered all well the login details the login and the password then you're gonna go to sign in all right so that is the sign in ladies and gentlemen just like that uh, you can see it says first max in the building so your balance is gonna reflect here and then this is what you're gonna use to trade you feel me i'm from series of web max you know the vibes uh if you watched through this far Thank you so much for the love and support. I'm gonna keep making content for y'all. Let me know what you wanna see next. It's your boy VC Banks, man. The match is limited edition, you're not gonna find it anywhere else. Alright, peace out.